Here's a Beyond the Pitch podcast quick hit from the WVSA Digital Network. Yeah, so one of the biggest misconceptions of protein powder is that it's necessary. That, you know, when you want to build muscle, you have to have a protein shake right after your workout. And when I started lifting in high school, I was the same way. And, like, I think back to how, like, you know, I would literally drink a protein shake on the way home, then go eat dinner, or one time, like, actually drinking my protein shake with my dinner and now realizing, like, that was so stupid. <laughs> um, but I'm sure people still do that because there's the whole marketing, like, all right, protein powder builds muscle, like, all that. But it, that's not how it works. Protein powder is just a source of protein. You know, whey protein is a very high-quality source of protein and it's definitely good for you, but it's not necessary. And, and that's what a lot of people need to understand is that you only have to use that protein powder if you can't get other protein from food in your diet or, um, you know, you just want an extra source. The way I say is protein powder is a convenience and just another source of protein for variety. So do a lot of my clients use protein powder? Yes. Um, do they have to? No. They can get meats in their diet. They can get yogurt, cheese, you know, beef jerky, things like that. But it just, it makes it easier sometimes, especially for busy athletes that, you know, need an on-the-go protein source or just want something just to add more variety.